So the Justice Department has now repealed the Trump policy of holding back block grant money, federal money, to the sanctuary cities. But not even more than that, the Justice Department issued a statement saying local law enforcement in the United States will no longer be required to cooperate with U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement as a condition for their funding. So the federal government is saying to the local police and state police, you don't have to obey federal law. Think about it. Federal law and our Justice Department, that's Merrick Garland. <laughs> don't worry about it. You don't have to cooperate with us. I've never seen anything like that. And you'll never hear about it on the network or cable news. And on that subject, yesterday I told you there are three things in America that are collapsing right before our eyes. The first is show business. It's over for the film and TV entertainment industry. O-V-E-R. People are walking away. The product's terrible. I got 100 channels. There's nothing I want to watch on 100 channels. The only network show I watch is Blue Bloods on CBS. Okay. Now, the, other, the second thing is journalism has collapsed totally because there are no standards. You can't believe what they tell you. Um, there's no competency. <laughs> it means people don't know what they're doing and they don't care. It's like going to a barber and you say, look, I just like a little trim, okay? And the guy shaves you bald. I mean, you know, come on. You got to have some level of skill. Not there anymore. And then religion. Organized religion, going to church. It's over. Okay? It's not coming back. Not in our lifetime. Because the culture disdains religion in America now. So let me prove this to you. Right after I gave my commentary yesterday, the April TV news cable numbers came out. I don't have the network uh, news numbers, but I will next week. Okay. CNN. Love them, right? Aren't they the best? AT&T owns it. They are down April of this year, 2021, to April of 2020. This is what we're comparing. In prime time, which is a big money maker, 47%. Half of their audience got. That is a catastrophe that is never before seen in the TV news industry. Now, I know some of you are cheering, but Fox News down 39%. 39%. And MSNBC down 22% primetime. But the reason is none of their primetime shows got an audience anyway. All right? So CNN came up with all the Trump bashing and the Capitol a riot and the uh, impeachment. CNN derived benefit. MSNBC so far left, they didn't get much pop. So they're only down 22%, but there's still nobody watches them. Fellow Americans, I am concerned about the U.S. dollar. Huge debt, as you know. Will it stay as the world's reserve currency? That's why now more than ever, I recommend you diversify with gold and silver. And the only company I recommend and have for years is American Hartford Gold. I trust them. I've personally done business with them. They sell physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your IRA. And they make it very easy. So call them right now. Make sure you tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you. And they will give you up to $2,500 of free silver on your first order. Since I have been recommending American Hartford Gold, gold shot up more than 40%. Silver, more than 60%. So don't wait. Call them now. 866-501-5201. 866-501-5201. Or text BILL to 65532. Again, that's 866-501-5201. Or text BILL to 65532. Bill O'Reilly here. Thank you for watching this video and make sure you subscribe to the First TV YouTube page. Just hit the big red subscribe button below and you'll get clips and highlights of my program, The No Spin News, 
every single day. We'll see you soon.